What's up Explorers, my name is James and I travel part time in my self converted 94 Chevy Astro. I love to be outdoors and I have a thing for film as you may can tell. So sit back, relax and enjoy the video. After a long hot day, this is definitely much needed. Thank goodness the middle of nowhere Virginia has the largest lake in Virginia. And this is one of the best lakes ever, if you ask me. I love this place. It's so vast. It goes all the way down into North Carolina. This is the best thing that has ever happened to the middle of nowhere Virginia. <laughs> I was going to get out here and do a little paddle boarding, but you know what? I changed my mind. I didn't really feel like getting the paddle board out. I just want to relax by the water and catch a vibe, you know, because it's been so stagnant for the past couple days with all this heat. And yeah, I just, I just want to relax by the lake i was about to say oh shit but i still want to relax by the lake and feel the breeze blowing in and just ah uh. It's so great when you have an area all to yourself. <sighs> it's nothing better than that if you ask me. Don't get me wrong, I like being social too. It's just when you're out in nature and you want to relax, unwind, and enjoy it a bit and you're by yourself, it just hits that much harder when you're by yourself. <laughs> I'm gonna hop back in the van and we're gonna talk a little bit more about the changes to the quality and creativity of the videos that's coming soon. All right, so these changes that we're going to be doing, they're gonna look a lot more cinematic. Things are gonna look so much smoother. The transitions are gonna be nice. The overall quality of the video I'm trying to get, I want things to be like a movie, like the ultimate experience when I go to places so y'all can experience to the best possible effect, if you know what I'm saying. That's been my goal the entire time that I've been making these videos. And I have had some progress as the people who have been following the channel for a while can see I was awkward in front of the camera at first and all of that. But now everything's gonna get a lot better and I cannot wait to put this into motion. up but i'm still learning i'm still here playing i'm getting better and better that's all that matters i'm gonna keep trying and keep practicing the uh the finger picking because 
I think I've gotten a little bit better at that as well, like... Still a work in progress, but we're getting there. <laughs> Oh, that keeps you from being so sticky and sweaty and because that water is going to evaporate right off your skin and it's going to create some fresh, dry skin. And it just feels so good. Uh, telling y'all, that's a cool, nice trick. The water bottle trick to stay cool in this heat. It works wonders, folks. It works wonders. <laughs> So the other night when I was over at Off Gridish, this place, this light was like very dim. I had to take this plate off and shake the wires and then it came on. So I'm kind of curious now if I turn them on, will that light come on? So let's see. All right. Yes, it looks like it's on. I don't know if I'm going to have to take the wires behind that, but... But the other night, that was not coming on at all. Thank goodness it's on. I've had this light bar for years. Half of the LEDs in it, they don't even work. Like, yeah, that's why I have the off-roading lights on my Amazon wish list. Because this thing, it's half burnt out. Alright y'all, so back from the lake. And I got my packages in. My mom called me and was like, hey, you got some packages. My KF Concepts Black Mist Filter, which makes everything look so cinematic. I'm using that right now, actually. You probably can't tell because it's not like the perfect light, not the, the good lighting condition for it at the moment. But I also got another Nano filter it's the ND variable filter by newer and it comes with a clip that I have clipped on to my phone right now and this is what the uh, ND filter looks like that goes over the iPhone camera it's a 67 millimeter it's for shooting in bright conditions it makes you able to get the right shutter speed so everything's gonna look smooth and buttery around here I'm so excited for that but y'all Honestly, I didn't have much going on today. I wanted to get these filters earlier so I could go shoot some different type of content, but it didn't happen. And I just wanted to keep y'all updated on what's going on. It's hot. As you could probably tell my face is so greasy and shiny. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, I am gonna put the camera down for tonight and chill and cool off and just enjoy these filters playing around with them and seeing what I can dial in and stuff. So thank you all for watching. I really appreciate each and every view and all of you subscribing and supporting the channel. Thank you so much. But as always, explores peace, love, and have a great day. Woo, my voice cracked. <laughs> have a great day wherever you are.